It was a much calmer day weather wise, but in Carson and Compton right here, people are still cleaning up after two tornadoes touched down there yesterday. Several businesses were damaged. KCAL's Rena Nakano shows us the big cleanup now. It's all hands on deck at New West Growers in Compton after an EF0 tornado ripped through the nursery Thursday morning, leaving a trail of destruction. Fly everything. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Camilla Hernandez was outside when the dark clouds began spinning above her. One by one, the 75 mile per hour winds plucked out metal pipes out of the ground, and black shade cloths and greenhouse plastics flew away, <laughs> getting caught in power lines and starting explosions. Because over there, the, the, the last greenhouse, that one's completely uh, untouched. Everything's perfect. And this is just, it looked like, uh, just took everything off from this side. Minutes before the tornado hit the Compton nursery, another EF0 struck a medical facility in Carson. Friday morning, workers there were retarping the roof with waterproof lining. The Hernandez family says Thursday was pure shock, but Friday is now a reality check. Customers still need their plants delivered, and it's a race against the clock to get their money makers back in sellable shape. Regardless of shade or not, or the structure of the, for the greenhouse, they have to be up there within a week, because if not, that's a lot of money that we lose. Hernandez expects at least one month and $40,000 to rebuild what his parents built here nearly 45 years ago. This is all ruined. A family business they hope will continue to grow despite a whirlwind of challenges. <laughs> Nobody hurts, no problemas. It's okay. No. You can rebuild this. No, I'm strong. It's okay. <laughs> In Compton, I'm Rena Nakano, KCAL News.